So this is what the RAM is supposed to look like. <laughs> look at the beauty of this. So you've got a you know, backward ones. I think he looks a little bit old. But look at the backward face ones. Right? Look at the main. Look at this. Look at this face. What a beautiful RAM. What a beautiful RAM. Look at his face. Right. Such a beautiful god. Look at his back. Look at his back, it's straightforward. So if you look at the difference between these and the boar gods is that you find that they're kind of you know slanted right here at the top, but look at this, it's quite beautiful. A little bit more straighter compared to boar gods, but the neck, look at the neck size, look at that thing. Look at the neck size, I mean it's beautiful. Look at the back. Look at that. Very, very awesome. Yes. Right. And then the set of balls right there at the back. Hanging. There's a bug you should have them. Beautiful. And look at opposite him. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. It's like a cow. It's like a cow. Right? So this is how we get back for a boy supposed to look like. So coming from the front, you look at the front right there. You've got a flat nose. You have a flat nose right here. And then look at the back, well shaped. And then look at the you look at the legs. I mean, the legs are quite huge. So it's a very beautiful specimen of a goat. Uh, same as this one right here next. No, same thing again, look at the power that it represents, look at the size, the width of the neck, I mean it's, it's quite awesome, look at this neck right here and then what it looks like, and then look at those holes right there, uh, and then look down there on the legs, they're kind of short, kind of you know, uh, uh, powerful, full of muscle, and then look at the width right there, the width of the neck, uh, that's a quite a strong width, and then obviously high legs, strong as well. Support the weight of the god, uh, and, and, and as we get the, the balls, I mean, quite, quite strong, long balls. Uh, and this is something that can obviously, you know, uh, uh, procreate and then give good genes to, to your head. To your so, this is quite a beautiful, beautiful thought. So yeah, I mean, this is just a specimen of a god. I mean, you cannot have it better than this. You cannot have it better than this. And this is likely to cost more than 150,000 uh, rand. So, I'm not sure if they've done the auction yet, but this is likely gonna cost all three of these. One, I mean, one cannot be less than a hundred thousand, hundred twenty thousand. Yeah, but uh, I guess we'll have to wait um, and just go through the auction. But this is quite great, quite a good set of, uh, a good set of bucks uh, that, that anyone can have. In terms of age, I think they're quite aged, uh, but I think they have three, 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 four years right in, inside them. Um, to, to to keep uh, 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 you know procreating for you if you are to buy something like this you know that for the next four years you are sorted in terms of uh, the genes and in terms of uh, beautiful thoughts for, for you and your crop so yeah this is something that obviously if you have money you, you need to come here and you need to you know see DP uh, auctions in Pretoria fire and wine estate uh, they have the auctions quite regularly it could be once a month, uh, obviously depending on goat availability, goat seasons as well. They're very reputable suppliers, very reputable breeders, you know, whether commercial or start breeders. They have them all here talking about your, I, I, I spoke about one of them, uh, Punde Brain for Kalahari Reds. Uh, and also uh, in terms of Burgos, some of you might have seen my video from last week where there was uh, 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 Lucas Becker, you know, he's one of the... 
uh, the, the best uh, uh, bull goat breeders in the country and obviously you know his goats are bound to go for that price because you are looking at quality you are looking at very good uh, uh, goats and uh, goats that are going to sustain your, your, your head for a very very long time uh, so yeah pass by Pretoria uh, and, 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 and you know even if you don't want to buy just spend some time here get to get the feeling spend some time sit in the crowd see how the breeding is done see how the uh, uh, um, and obviously the front and back goes when it comes to bidding and uh, hopefully by the time you come back you'll be more confident in terms of placing a bid and, and ultimately winning that bid and going home with one of these pretty pretty uh, uh, solid bulls marks for your for your head <laughs> Look at this ram, it's a very beautiful ram, very big, look at this, specimen, look at this. Beautiful ram. And this is the other rams.